Hello, my name is Dave Warnicky. Welcome down to Facty Fact Sleepover Club, the only bedroom quiz show that's cooler than your mum's new boyfriend, Dan. <laughs> what a guy. And sleeping over tonight, now we all know the best thing since sliced bread is Dunkaroos. And the best thing since Dunkaroos, it's Geraldine Hickey and Tommy Dasselow. Yay! And facing off against them tonight, it's Wes Wally's slightly more memorable uh, brother and sister, it's Demi Lardner and Nick Kaffer. Yay! Hey guys, uh, welcome to my bedroom. Uh, now we're obviously surrounded by the remnants of my childhood. Every toy here is mine. Um, do you guys ever have anything from your childhood, a toy that you really wanted but your parents never got for you? This is pretty bad. Um, a ventriloquist dummy? <laughs> <laughs> oh, look who's sitting next to you! <laughs> <Yeah>. Hey, Demi! <laughs> I obviously that. didn't have any practice. Uh, <laughs> I lived on a cotton anything. farm by myself. I needed a friend. You need water. You need a glass of water. Do the, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. Hey, Demi. Uh, hey, mate. <laughs> oh, don't say that. You're so naughty. <laughs> You're a I bad got, dummy. I, oh, oh that hurts quit my wooden talking. head. Quit talking. I got a ventriloquist dummy when I asked for it. Dream from childhood. my parents. See, I, I am good. I was yeah. drinking the water. Well, it looked exactly that. like me as well. It was really upsetting. <laughs> <laughs> That's so meta, the ventriloquist dummy talking to you about how it got a ventriloquist dummy. <laughs> yeah, That's know, insane. Right? I got everything I wanted when I was a kid. My parents were divorced. So. Oh, okay. what, was, uh, well. what was number one? What was the best thing that you ever got? Um, I, no, because I got desensitised to getting things. So I was like, can I have this? And they were like, yeah, and I got it. And I was like, no, it's not. Uh, the sweetest oh. gift of all. Wow. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to take a point off for being a little shit there. Uh, yes. Wow, that, one for those guys that... Is that well, why well, you I have two, two watches? Like one from each parent? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. What time is it? Time for an unhappy marriage. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Screw you, Mum. I'll get time from the dad today. Yeah. yeah. All right, we're going to get going with round number one, which tonight we're very lucky to have Dave's Google Game. Dave's Google Game. Google game. It's time for Dave's Google Game. It is time for <laughs> Dave's Google Game, or as uh, I like to call it, Dave's Googler Game, um, to avoid copyright there. <laughs> <laughs> now, with this round, we've got uh, 10 adjectives and 10 nouns, each in columns ranked from 1 to 10 in terms of how sexy they are. Each of our teams have to pick one word from column A, an adjective, and one word from column B. We're going to Google that search together, and you'll be given points equal to column one times column two. For example, if you picked uh, wet, four points, and balls, six points, you would get four times six, 24 points. So the higher up you go, the more points you get. However, if the number one Google image result is pornographic or sexual in nature, you will get zero points. So you want to try and push it really high, but not too high. So for example, I'll help you out here, don't Google Fuck cock. Um, <laughs> I've tried it many times and uh, it never ends well. So throwing over to uh, Geraldine and Tommy. Okay. Do we do this as a team? As a team? I'm thinking horny cock. Oh, horny nice. cock, which would be 90 points. Well, here's the thing. I'm thinking horny because it could all be also relate to like a like an animal. You've never yes. been on the internet, have you? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Let's pretend that's true. Yeah. Could. Uh, and then cock for like a type of bird. Yeah. Yeah, you go, guys. Oh. Yeah, yeah, do that. Or take the plunge. Or you could like that's yeah. that's just going for maximum <laughs> points. Yeah. Like, I think maybe horny balls <laughs> is a little bit safer. Yeah. yeah. I feel like that's that's like the the like the you know the lowest one down yeah. that I would feel comfortable. <laughs> Okay. Would be horny balls. Yeah, I'm with you on that. Horny yeah. balls. All right, we'll lock horny that in for you. Horny balls. Horny. All right, so they've gone for horny balls, 54. Are you going to go try higher than that or assume that that is sexual and just go for an easy one? What do you reckon? I was thinking either bulging ass. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty good. That's pretty yeah. Great. That's pretty good. Bulging. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm obsessed with bulging. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I what know. A, what about a naked cock? Because, I mean, <laughs> you a cock can't idiot. get naked. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> What could you possibly what about, be <laughs> What about, I really think bulging ass is the way to go, and that's not the first time I've said that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I'll, I'll go with you, man. Going with yeah. bulging ass, 25 points. Yeah, because I think this is going to oh. be fucked. <laughs> I'd like to put it all on the line. Oh, okay, yeah, let's go. Even yeah. If no, you can what? I, I, reckon, I reckon we go with, with um, naked cock. 
You reckon? Yeah, I reckon. Yeah, do it. Really? Yeah. <laughs> do it. <laughs> do you really want it? Yeah. I, if you really I want, want to it. I want to see a rooster with no clothes. Okay. <laughs> oh, a rooster I'll, sh- I'll just, cock. I'll just oh, show you. A, I'll just show you a rooster with no clothes. If that's the only reason that we're doing this. <laughs> So, uh, Kappa, rolling yeah, the can... dice there with naked cock. All right, well, yeah, let's, <laughs> let's do it. 70 <laughs> points. Suddenly, Horny Balls is looking pretty good. <laughs> All right, so we're going to start with our Horny Balls, because that was the lowest score of 54 points. Horny Balls. Here we go. Oh! Yeah! oh Shit! Oh, no! Shit! Oh, 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 yeah! Doomed. We're doomed. This oh is my God. gonna be the exact same. <laughs> We're gonna get the same picture. It oh, looks, that looks animal. It, do, it looks like an eel or something. Like yeah. It. <laughs> it's because yeah. it's got a curve. Yeah. Like a, like but it's only got a brain at the end, like it's had an idea. Uh, uh, now, next up, uh, Kappa, how are you feeling about <laughs> naked <laughs> cock? <laughs> <laughs> I reckon the same image will come yeah. up. Yeah. yeah. Naked yeah. cock. Wait, look it up. Here we go. Oh, so much pressure. No! Oh! Oh! oh. oh. Yeah. Make yeah, but you sportsman. can't see yeah. the, the dick hole. You... Yeah. <laughs> I, I think I think that's clinical. If yeah. Any. Oh my god. Yeah. Uh, what? But like. That's weird that, yeah, that, that's the number one result for naked cock, and you can't even it's see the even cock. It's not even technically a naked cock. No, You'd be better to search for horny balls if you want to see cock. Yeah. Was that the hamburger that he was doing? Well, yeah, I think he's oh, got, maybe, it is, yeah. I think it's the hamburger. Yeah. Is he doing the, the hamburger? Ha- what? Oh. oh look at, what's that guy doing there? Can in we the not ask any more questions about dicks and balls? <laughs> <laughs> All right. I just so, have a couple uh, more. At the end of <laughs> round number one, uh... I'm feeling a little inadequate, and uh, <laughs> looking at the scores <laughs> on uh, minus one points, it's uh, Demi and Nick Kappa, yeah. who are trailing Yay. Tommy okay. and Geraldine on zero points. Yes! Yay. Yay. How did we get minus one? Because I was a dickhead. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, really? Because of my parents. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, that's true. Round number two tonight is Dave's <laughs> Weight Game. Yeah! <laughs> The game where our contestants have to decide whether things are heavier, lighter, or the same as me. And just to uh, give you a bit of background, I weigh 52 kilos and uh, have a BMI, a body mass index of 16.9, which according to a, <laughs> according to a Vic Health website, I'm uh, po- uh, dangerously underweight, possibly malnourished. <laughs> <laughs> our first one tonight, guys, heavier, lighter, or the same as me is 600 eggs. Oh, 600 eggs. What do you guys reckon? Do you think 600 eggs are heavier, lighter, or the same as me? 52 kilos worth. Heavier. <laughs> um, wow. <laughs> <laughs> no <laughs> right reason. Just heavier. Is that your method for working it out? Just yeah, I'm just trying to visualise <laughs> yourself right. holding 600 <laughs> eggs, get cradling a naked dead boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, this is pretty heavy. Well, I'm just what parts of him are you holding on to? Uh, you mean like you roughly the same? Lighter. Yeah, pretty close. Yeah. yeah, actually. Yeah, I think you're So we've right. got one lighter, one the same. Yep. We're going to find out 600 eggs are lighter oh. than I yeah. am. Yeah. Yeah. Quite yeah. That was all you. Uh, they would weigh about 43 kilos. 43 oh. kilos. So if you want to make an omelette in the size of Dave Warnicke. You've got to get... Like 700 eggs? 700 eggs, eggs yeah, approximately. Okay. <laughs> I weigh 700 eggs. Is that, that's a way to pick up women. I weigh 700 eggs. <laughs> <laughs> you can come over and fertilise mine. <laughs> <laughs> High five, Marie. Right. Yeah. Uh, our next one is um, Michael Jackson at the time of his death. Oh. <laughs> Michael Jackson at the time of his death. Heavier, lighter, or the same as I am? Now, he fluctuated a lot in his career. Sure. Uh, but at the time of his death, Michael Jackson, heavier, lighter, or the same as me? Kappa, what do you reckon? Like, uh, just before he died, or...? Like, when they weighed him for the autopsy. Oh. I, I want to know the time when he wore a cardigan. <laughs> like, I've never seen... <laughs> so good, isn't it? <laughs> he had so many clothes, and he's just like, no, this, this is the cardigan. I'm rocking. <laughs> just, to, um, just again, to help me visualise, can you do a bit of Jackson gear for us right now? <laughs> <laughs> just give us a small... <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, All right, that's actually helped a lot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and Thank God. and now, didn't... just to help me visualise, can you tell me how much he weighs? <laughs> I reckon same. 
Same? Yeah. MJ at the time of death was the same weight as me. What do you guys think? I reckon he was pretty... Uh, I reckon maybe heavier. Heavier. Do you reckon heavier? Yeah. I reckon heavier? he was the same weight as Blanket, but probably not. <laughs> 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 You've got a mask over there. I'll chuck it on. Wait, I didn't get to say mine. So you're a chain mate. Yeah, but nobody asked me what I thought. I reckon she's got some sweet pedo gear lined up. So <laughs> right, so <laughs> something's happening. Come on, no one's made the joke yet. What no. is it, Demi? Uh, no, I was just going to say the same as Cap. I just, I'd like to be asked. <laughs> <laughs> we've got the same, and Pedos. we've got heavy, heavier, heavier than me. Heavier, yeah. Michael Jackson, the time of death was 62 kilos. Yes. Oh. 62 kilos. Oh. So a point there to... Uh, Great to minds me. think alike. That's yeah. right, all right. We have one final one tonight. Uh, the final one is Hitler's... Legendary spoon collection. <laughs> Did it weigh more than me? Heavier, lighter, or the same? Oh well, yeah, that thing we've all heard of. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Legendary spoon collection. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is <laughs> deceiving. Can you tell us how many spoons it was? No, I cannot. Cannot confirm. He's legendary oh. for having this collection, so it's probably more than. All oh, right, yeah. If, if I just dig deep into my memories, yeah, I, I should already know. know. Is it, I'm <laughs> thinking <laughs> that there is no spoon collection, therefore it's lighter. Oh. it isn't. Like we that haven't time. heard of his legendary spoon collection because there is no legendary spoon collection. Oh, oh. so it's lighter. I reckon blankets trying to trick us. Can uh. This. Oh fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> no, I Even feel like. I feel okay if this gets edited out, but was it a thing to do with Hitler where people used to hit themselves on the boner with spoons? Oh no, that's that's like a that's in the war. Okay. So um, so Hitler. <laughs> yeah. Which Sorry, Hitler was uh, not? Kappa, can you elaborate? <laughs> Sorry, what war? No, when, <laughs> the no, war on boners. No, when the um the soldiers you would get injured in the war. Um, they would. That, and then when they woke up in the hospital and the nurse would be working on them, and if they got a boner, the, the nurse would hit the boner with a spoon. What it's for? like it because like they're like come what? down. I'm just <laughs> like I'm trying to heal you. <laughs> what, and then he was bloody. And then he was walking up and going, "Can I grab that?" <laughs> yeah, he's done with it. <laughs> he's collecting <laughs> for me collection. <laughs> he's got a binder and everything. <laughs> like imagine it was a soldier's fetish. And, and he wakes and up their, and he's going, oh, their boner just got the best thing ever. Yeah. And then just the nurse going, oh, it's not fucking working. Yeah. And he's just constantly Beating on the battle up. lines, like sending himself out, yeah. like he's on yeah. the front lines. I've got this. And yeah. I think oh, that may be where the phrase whack him off comes from. Yeah. Yeah. I think that out. might be where the phrase hit in the dick with a spoon came from. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. I'm actually. I'm, I'm, Really I sorry I brought it up. <laughs> I didn't think I'd say this, but uh, let's bring it back to Hitler. <laughs> <laughs> is it a uh, heavier, lighter, or the same as me? I, I'm going to go with Geraldine's thing. I reckon this doesn't exist and therefore it's lighter. Lighter? Lighter. What do you think? I, I reckon it's heavier. Yeah, yeah, heavier. Yeah. It's a big spoon collection. Yes. yes. We're going to find out lighter, heavier, Hitler's legendary spoon collection. It does not exist! Yeah. Yeah. Well played, it is legendary. So uh, you yeah. can actually, if you go on eBay, if you uh, uh, want to find some Hitler memorabilia, up to don't a we which I do. <laughs> people pay up to $1,000 for a spoon, that, a teaspoon that may or may not have touched Hitler's lips. It's got the Nazi insignia on it, so oh. check that out in your spare time. <laughs> I'd pay for one that hit his dick. <laughs> yeah. Would you? I wouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> hey, maybe you should have asked your parents that for, uh, for your birthday. <laughs> Since I get everything of both parents. Mum, I don't ask for much. It'd be funny if your um, your uh, mum gave you Stalin's spoon. <laughs> yeah, gave you Hitler's spoon. This is. Nick's <laughs> mum got him a Hitler spoon for Christmas. <laughs> You got Genghis Khan spoon. <laughs> That's a really old spoon. <laughs> uh, so at the end of round number two, we're going to do a, a quick score check on zero points. It's Demi and Nick Kappa. Yeah. 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 But on two points, it's the legendary Tommy Dasselow and Jeremy yeah. Higgins. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to take this baby home with the final bedroom challenge now. And uh, because the scores are so close, this is for five points. The winning team of this round will 
win the show. Really? Ooh. And you are also competing oh. to break a world record. This one is Ooh. the fastest time to blow up a balloon until it pops using only your nose. Using only your nose to blow it up. And you've already elected Demi with a smiley face balloon, facing off against uh, Geraldine Hickey with Welcome Home as your balloon. <laughs> and uh, I will be timing you. And remember, it's the first one to uh, blow it up until it pops. Until it pops. So you will be timed to break the world record. Nostrils at the ready. Here we go. Uh, three, two, two, one, blow! Yes, yes! Come on, nice. come on! Not into that balloon. Yeah. Do it! Yeah. Come on, you got it. Come Keep on. Going. Keep it going. Welcome home! Keep it going. Come on, come Get on. In it. Come on. Come on. <laughs> that was amazing. Uh, checking in, you did that uh, in a time of <coughs> 50 seconds. Uh, Narrowly missing out of the world record by um, 33 seconds. <laughs> uh, pretty close, pretty good. But uh, round of applause for Demi Lardner. Yeah. Can we, can we quickly applaud Hickey's tactic of getting three yeah. seconds in and going, fuck this, I'm cheating, and just <laughs> trying to smoosh it into the. Yeah, there were no, that is not cheating. There were no rules. You said blow it up with your nostrils. Until it pops. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah. That's we, uh, true. We can't really argue with that. I'm going to give five points to each team. <laughs> yes. Yay. Yay. I, don't know, I don't know why I said this is great. So uh, checking Logic in. Logic went through again. <laughs> checking in the final scores at the end of the show in a total of five points. Uh, she's probably uh, struggling to breathe. It's Demi Lardner <laughs> and Nick Yay. For yeah, winning the yeah, show yeah. and seven points is oh. Tommy Deslo and Geraldine Hickey yeah. for the winner. Yeah. The bad boys are fucky fat. Yeah. Yeah. Um, that's probably sticking to that cupboard from my nose juice. So, <laughs> <laughs> oh. so I'm just really sorry. I'm not going to look at that. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, Mum's about to come in. It's time to uh, pack this set up and go to bed. <laughs> One more time for our steamed guests. Yeah. <laughs> My name is Dave Warnicky. Goodbye. Yeah. Hey, thanks for watching Facty Fact. If you want to watch some more episodes of that, you can click my forehead and subscribe. Or if you click my chin, you can watch the next episode right now. Forehead or chin? Which one will it be? I feel like that's a lot enough. <laughs>